Hey, hi everyone. This is Mukesh from learn-automation.com. Today, we are going to start with another series with test project and test project is one of the tool which I found recently and trust me, I fall in love with this tool after using it. I'm sure you will also love it once you start using it. So before wasting much time, let's get started. So in this video, we will be talking about what exactly is test project, why we are using it, some benefits and some unique selling points about the test project and uh, we will also talk about some other features throughout the session. Okay, so what is test project? So test project is completely free end-to-end -end test automation platform, okay, which works with uh, web automation, mobile automation and API automation. Any kind of automation which falls under this category, test project will be the perfect fit for you. Now. When you talk about platform, what are the platforms supported by test project? So guys, whatever platform you use, all are supported by test project. So if you're working with Windows, Mac, Linux, all these platforms are supported. And when it comes to mobile, it also supports Android and iOS devices. It's not only the simulator part guys, it also supports the real devices. We'll talk about these two unique features in detail once we start. As of now, all these platforms are supported by test project. Now, why we are talking about test project? Because we also have many other tools in the market. We have Selenium, which is completely open source free. We have test complete. We also have Catalon, which also provides many inbuilt features, complete uh, IDE, everything. But why we are jumping into test project or what is unique in the test project that I am pitching in and why you should move on. So not only these tools guys, these are just few names I have taken, but there are so many tools in the market, which also provide many other features. So before I move to the actual um, test project site, I want to highlight a couple of points, which makes test project completely unique. Okay, so let's get started with the features before we jump into the actual portal. First of all, it's free. Definitely they have different plans. So I will walk you through all the plans which they have. Free plan provides the all in all the features that test project has to offer are completely free. So I'm also using the free plan and I'm able to automate almost every single kind of application. And it has so many features. Once I start the planning part, uh, different plans which they have, you will get to know about what they include in the free plan. Okay. So the next point is agents. Test project works on the agents uh, concept. So if you have multiple machines, you simply need this agent. So definitely, let's say if you have three synth system, uh, Linux, Mac and Windows, then you need agent for all. That's all you need. And test project will allow you to run on different machines. You don't need much configuration. Once you just install this agents and you just registered with the test projects, you can run the test on any agent. Even they are on one location, different location remotely, you can easily access them. Now, if you work with the different tools, which is available in the market, or if you try about this master slave configuration, there's so much configuration and headache you need to take. You need to establish the connections. You need to connect with the JNLP. There's so much configuration and it takes a lot of time to run the test on the distributed environment. But when it comes to test project, it's not. You just need to install the agent for the different platforms. Once they're registered, you can distribute your test to the different agents. No code or less code. Once I start, you will notice that we don't need coding or any Java or any other programming experience. Definitely when you have to customize and you, when you have to write complex code, definitely you need it. But that is also very less. So we'll talk about this coding part and no, uh, no code or less code. So once we talk about the SDK part because it also supports different SDKs as this moment Java and Shisha but in future you will get Python, Groovy and many other SDKs as well. So this was our next point in case if you want to customize or extend your test definitely you can take the help of these SDKs which is available. So mostly right now Java and Shisha which are highly in demand they already support and other SDKs are coming soon. And this is one of the most interesting and unique selling point for test project. That you can test 
you can run your automated test on the real devices and the simulators but you should again ask then what is the unique here the unique point here is guys the configuration part now if you want to run your automated test on android what you need you need definitely android sdk you need apm you need node.js you need several other configuration you need to set all the path and all right but what if i tell you that you don't need in test project you just connect to device once the device is recognized you can directly trigger your test on the mobile devices pretty right pretty amazing feature which they already provided now another important point now if you want to run ios test what if you talk about other tools we need to again set up the x code right we again have to set up F A apm and everything but when it comes to test project you don't have to do all this even if you have windows system you can run your test on the ios devices okay so that is again very interesting feature which uh, test project guys have provided and we will be using that feature in upcoming videos and it's a web based project so again it's a web portal you just need to sign in you will see all the jobs which you have created you can run from anywhere you can see the reports even you can see from your mobile devices so if you have like any phone or okay, tab or any device which have the browsers you just log into the portal and you can see everything whether it's a report whether it's a analytics trend everything is available and the last point is team collaboration again it's very important and very interesting feature guys like you can collaborate easily in test project so you can invite team members so they have a separate functionality where if you're working as a team you can invite other team members and you guys can share the code you can share the reports add-ons elements anything which you want you can share with the help of this feature so i will be talking about these features one by one once we move forward but these are the high level points which i want to highlight portal so now test project i use the official site which you guys have to refer and if you see i have taken this particular line that it's a completely free end to end automation platform for web mobile and apis how it works first of all you need to create account here okay so if you are completely new to test project definitely you need to hit this button and it will ask you a couple of details and you just need to fill up these details i already have a account here so i am able to log in it but if you are the first uh, first time customers then definitely you need to fill up these details you will get a verification mail and that's all you need now if you see this part these are the key benefits which we already discussed okay uh, community powered there's a big community for test project which i will show you apart from that selenium apm ready supercharged with add-ons so guys this is the again part which i want to highlight that they have ready made add-ons okay you can just download these add-ons or plug in with your project and you can start using it you can also build your own add-ons which will definitely help your team members or other community guys they can build or do some stuff very fast it's like reusability so already they guys have multiple add-ons but in case if you want to build your own add-ons you can do that again this is uh, same thing which we already discussed it's a powerful tool with analytics you can do the collaborative uh, like sharing basis easy deployment and the devops tool integration so the test project which we are talking right now we can integrate with any other ci tool as well so let's say if we are using jenkins team city bamboo or any other uh, ci server you can easily integrate and you can run it okay and with this image itself you can see there's so many points you can take from this single image itself so this is the test project and this is what it used underneath you can see these add-ons and you can see all the tools it's used what are the platform it supports and these are the sdks right one single image explains everything here okay and now if you see this part let me show you one by one when it comes to platform okay so they have a recorder okay we'll talk about this once we move forward they 
आई हैव मल्टीपल एड ऑन्स पावरफुल एस डी केस जावन ची शार्प एंड डेफिनेटली द ट्रेंड एंड एनालिटिक्स अबाउट योर टेस्ट सेकेंड थिंग इज अबाउट द डॉक्स कब सो वे टॉक अबाउट द डॉक कंप्लीट डॉक्यूमेंटेशन दे हैव एंड इट्स वेरी ब्यूटिफुल डॉक्यूमेंटेशन विच दे हैव क्रिएटेड सो वॉट एवर काइंड ऑफ हेल्प यू नीड यू जस्ट फॉर दिस डॉक्यूमेंटेशन एंड यू विल बी गेटिंग हेयर Plus, they also have given the release notes in which release what things they are providing. Okay, and everything you will get under this section. Next thing is the blog. This is just like uh, whatever new updates they have or whatever new topic they found. They simply update on the their project. Okay, so recently, like today itself, uh, they launched a new feature. Like you can get your uh, code from the recorded test okay so let's say you recorded one test in uh, test project it will generate the c sharp code for you another tab is forum tab now forum tab is amazing feature like they have a dedicated forum where you can discuss all the features or anything which is uh, you want to discuss about the project release or what are the new features are coming if you want to add on any new features feedback or if you stuck somewhere you can directly post here and you will get the answer with the community okay so these are quick links which i have already uh, explained here okay uh, let me quickly do the login part the moment you say login it will redirect to app.testproject.io and uh, the last part which i want to cover before jumping into dashboard when you come to plans so now if you come down to the pricing part they have two plans one is free forever and you can see it's zero dollar lifetime and second one is the plus so if you come down to this free part they have given all the list which they offer so unlimited agents user test execution project everything they have listed down here so just go through this whatever you have in the free plan but yes definitely if you have to you know if you have any specific requirement or you need more storage or if you need their assistance or if you need some help you can definitely go with the custom plans and you can contact them through this or you can also see this chat box where you can contact and uh, you know you can have a chat or if you're facing some technical issue or any other issue related to pricing or anything you can directly check with them okay the moment you log into test project you will get these kind of options it looks like they have many options yes definitely they have but they are very straightforward let me show you one by one what things you need and how to get started so definitely i will give you the overview about all these options we have right now but in the next videos we'll talk about each and every module one by one so as usual you will get the home page in the home page you will get the add-ons which is recommended by them which are highly used and you can see this add-on of the week frequently used and the popular ones so this is element extension javascript actions and web actions these are the android not only android you will get for ios and for web for almost every platform you will find some add-on which you can download and use it on the right hand side you can see the recent activity whatever activities you did it just will show you the recent activities and under this section it will show you the projects now let's get started with the job monitors now we haven't created anything because we just started but under this section it will show you how many jobs you created how many times you executed what was your agent when is the next execution every single details you will get here and they will also provide you one search box where you can search for the jobs these are the add-ons which we discussed just now so they have categories featured one new and updated one test project add-ons and many other things and in case if you want to create your own add-on definitely you can do that report sections you don't need multiple tools multiple libraries one test project has everything which includes your agents add-ons test cases reports everything so under report section you will get the uh, all the reports and you can see the filter here you can see the last three days seven days 30 days whatever executions reports you want you will get it here and these are the agents 
right now we just started no agents connected but whatever agents you have connected all will come here and you can see we can see how many agents are ideal disconnected everything as of now no agents so we cannot use this filter but once we move forward we have to register multiple agents and i will show you how to use it most interesting feature of test project is the agent part just register this agent and run it from anywhere okay and this is the developers tag uh, tab like in case if you want to build again some tests some extension test or it can be let's say some advanced test which you don't want to directly record you can build your test using any of the SDK so as of now you can see if you're working with Java you can download the Java SDK and if you want to see the quick guide so if you have worked on any other programming language okay then it is very easy for you and if you have worked on Java then it's very straightforward for you if you see you just need to use this Maven dependency and if you're using Gradle then use this and this is how you need to create the test they have created a couple of uh, classes interfaces for you so simply you have to use it let's just see this example helper.getDriver it will return you the driver and you can continue this is the page object model which they have given so in case if you want to go with your custom code definitely you can do that same goes with C sharp if you are working with C sharp you can also get the same guide and you can go with the C sharp as well okay and if you click on other SDKs definitely they are on the pipeline they will be releasing soon it is just you need to wait a little bit so javascript coming soon python and groovy and trust me guys once these sdks are released it is going to be very powerful still it is very powerful but those who are working with groovy python javascript they're still not able to leverage more but definitely once we have these all sdks available it will give more values and this is again like you can create a new test you can invite your team members and this is your all the profiles so when you say new tests again it will ask you which kind of test you want and uh, what are the agents and every details so in the next videos we have to create our test and we will be using test project and we will be using all these options so i will give this task to you just create account log into the portal see all the options in the next video i will show you how you can use all these features efficiently with the help of one test okay so that's all i have for this video and uh, if you have any question then let me know and i will see you in the next video have a nice day bye bye